Good morning. Today we're here at Kroger. We're going to go and check out some of the sales prices for the week, some of the things you guys have asked about, and check the shelves. Let's get to it. As soon as we walk into Kroger here, we see they've got the pork back ribs, $2.99 a pound, uh, part of their weekly digital deal. Nice to have right up front and center in front of the carts. Going to grab one of these bad boys so we don't miss anything. As soon as we come inside, we see they've got their pop on sale. The six packs here, the 16.9 ounce uh, pop here. All Coca-Cola, Pepsi, and 7 Up products, four for $12, making them $3 a piece. So we also notice here that 12 packs of Coca-Cola and Pepsi products buy three or more, $5.99 a piece, which really isn't much of a deal compared to what they've had. $6.99 now regularly, though, for one 12-pack pop is just getting pretty expensive so last week it was the 80 20 in the tube this week it is the 73 27 in a tube three pound package for eight dollars and 37 cents that is a pretty good deal 279 a pound but you have to buy in the three pack or the three pound package there 1249 regular price always getting comments on ground turkey so i thought i would point out they have the kroger 85 percent lean ground turkey which is actually pretty good uh, two for seven dollars. So uh, you don't have to buy two though. You can just buy one. Three fifty regular price. Four forty nine for one. It's a pretty good deal. Heritage Farm Chicken continues to be on sale here. They do have the chicken drumsticks for dollar twenty nine a pound. Regularly a dollar ninety nine a pound. Uh, we're not big fans of Heritage Farm. We got the chicken breast a couple weeks ago when they were on sale. I gotta say, I did not like them. Um, we have a couple frozen that we probably won't even make. We we have some more frozen uh, from Sam's Club. But yeah, I don't know. The Heritage Farm chicken breast was really tough. Really tough. Uh, we made chicken and dumplings with it, and I don't know. It just, it did not taste the same. They do have some sales on the Simple Truth Organic Chicken Breast Tenders. $8.99 uh, a pound, usually $9.99 a pound. You know, this stuff's pretty expensive, but we get a lot of comments on it, so I like to point it out. They also have the chicken thighs here, $6.99 a pound, normally $8.99 a pound. So, decent deal all considering here. Kroger's has digital coupons on their Italian sausage, sweet Italian sausage, all their different sausage links here. Uh, $3.99 for one pack. Regularly $5.99, so that's a pretty good deal these days. I remember when this was the regular price about a year ago. Here are those pork back ribs here for $2.99 a pound. Uh, regularly $4.99 a pound, so the digital coupon with these is pretty good. You can use up to five times too, so that's a pretty good deal. Looks like they got their pork chops back on sale. They are $2.99 a pound, down from $4.99 a pound to the regular price. Regular price on these did go up to $5.99 a pound, so it's good to see the regular price drop a dollar. But on sale this week, $2.99. Also, here is a ton more of the meat in a tube, 73% lean, $2.79 a pound, $8.37. I mean, this would be great. I, I wouldn't do like hamburgers with this or nothing, but for like tacos, stuff that you mix in, a lot of different, you know, seasonings and stuff, this would be pretty good. So we got some comments about the digital coupons and if you can use up to five times on all of them. Every one that I've ever seen, you could use up to five times. Uh, Ice Mountain Water 24 pack, $2.99 on the digital coupon this week. You can use up to five times. Regular price on this has shot up to $5.49. Now a week ago, the regular price was $4.79. So keep that in mind. Kroger's does still have their Gatorade 30, or I'm sorry, the shrinkflated 28 ounce Gatorades for $1.25. It says four for five, but you don't have to buy. Uh, no, okay, now it says when you buy four or more. Okay, see, some trickery in here because it didn't used to be like that. They may be changing that. Um, they are $1.69 each otherwise, which is ridiculous. It does seem like Kroger's has an absolute crazy amount of digital coupons this week. Um, so we always get a lot of comments on the digital coupons. The easiest way I can say to do it is to go on your home computer or laptop and digitally, digital, digitally <laughs> clip the coupons and put them to with your Kroger account, right? So you'll add it to your Kroger Plus card. Now what I do is at the end 
when I'm done checking out, I'll put in my phone number on the little keypad. I lost my card years ago, but I, I have never ha heard a problem with someone who uses their phone number that is linked with their account. So you just clip the coupons instead of coming in here and scanning all these QR codes. You don't need to do that. You could also do it on your phone on the app. You can go through and you can digitally clip the coupons. But I recommend doing it from your home so you can look at everything, kind of get a good idea of what you're going to get, how much you're going to spend. Everyone who's been watching the channel for a while knows that we love our Pringles. However, we refuse to pay $1.89 for them. So when they're on sale like this, we do tend to buy up a few. $1.29 on the digital coupon this week. Uh, and you can buy up to five times. We got a comment the other day that someone was having trouble finding AngelSoft. Just thought I would point this out. Um, they do have it at Kroger. Uh, now we see low price here, $12.79. This is not on sale. This is the regular price. Um, now... If you do use AngelSoft and you like it, I would recommend buying one or two of these this week because when we sell, when we see low price here at Kroger, that usually means in the next week or two, it's going up in price. So keep that in mind. Always want to check the middle aisles and everywhere where they have the sales packed in. Um, we've gotten a lot of comments on these Snapple drinks here. Uh, these are four for five, but if you see here, you do only have to buy one because it doesn't say that you have to buy four. If it doesn't say you have to buy four and it says the price, $1.25 each right here, then all you have to do is use your Kroger Plus card and you can get them for $1.25. However, if you drink these a lot, they are $1.79 once the sale is over a piece. So I would recommend buying, you know, as many as you think you're going to have until the next sale. Which, uh, they have the three pounds of the mandarins here for $4.99. We've seen some places go up to $5.49, even $5.99, so that's not too bad of a deal. And uh, we also have the navel oranges here. These are only $0.89. Cents. They have low price on it, though, so you know what that means. Uh, and these have gone up to $1.29 a piece at Meijer, so I have a feeling oranges are going to be going up. So really, lately, this is about the cheapest we've seen. We've been seeing watermelons go back up in price. Most of them have been right around $5.99. $4.99 here this week. We keep seeing kiwi fruit go up in price, so I wanted to point out this sale here. $3.99 for one pound of the Zespri, which seems to be most of the kiwi fruit going around here. Regular price, we see here $4.79. $4.79, that is ridiculous. $3.99 is still ridiculous, but cheaper than that. Uh, we saw at Costco, three pounds of the Zespri was $8.99, so still expensive, but cheaper than this. So with bananas, we continue to see them kind of go up and down. Kroger's here had them back, they were up to $0.55 cents a pound, and they went down to $0.49 cents a pound again. And it said low price, and we said, sure enough, it's going to go back up again. It did at $0.55 cents a pound, and it says low price. That kind of tells me that bananas may actually be going up more. Would you look at this? We actually found some yellow onions. Uh, some people have been saying they haven't been able to find yellow onions anywhere across the country. Uh, we've been having trouble ourselves. Actually found some here. They are $2.59 for a three pound bag. More importantly, they have them in. Looks like we might be getting ready for a jump in produce, fresh produce here. We're seeing red leaf lettuce. $1.99 low price. They wouldn't put low price on this if if it wasn't about to go up because, you know, that's just the... I, I had never seen a low price sticker on these. So, like the romaine lettuce here, the um, green leaf lettuce, the red leaf lettuce. We saw that celery had gone up at Meijer. Uh, was it two nineteen? dollars I think it was two nineteen. dollars $1.69 here. It says low price on it, so this is probably going to be going up too. Definitely not the cheapest place to buy peppers, but $1.39 a piece. We saw at Meyer they are $1.69 a piece. $1.69. The green ones are a little cheaper. These are $0.89 cents a piece at Meyer right now on sale here for $0.79 cents a piece. But we see these went up. The regular price is $0.99 cents a piece. Now, these were $0.79 cents a piece for the regular price not that long ago, a couple weeks ago. I think I even said in a couple different videos that asparagus was going to be going up because we've been seeing it go up everywhere. Well, they have low price on here. $2.99 is the regular price. It was $3.19 and then went down to $2.99. 
probably go up to 319, 329. We'll just have to wait and see. Uh, it seems to be about 319 everywhere though, except for Kroger. So uh, they also have a low price on squash. See, a lot of this produce is they're putting the low prices on. It's telling me that it's about ready to go up again. They have these giant avocados on sale for $2. Um, usually these are $2.49. So it's a pretty good deal. Um, yeah, that one don't look too bad. Make some guacamole. They've got their private selection snacking tomatoes, cherry tomatoes on sale here this week, two for five dollars. Regularly three forty nine. You do not have to buy two. You can just buy one, two fifty each. Uh, these are okay. They're pretty good. Um, yeah, for two dollars and fifty cents, that's pretty good. They do have a digital coupon this week on the peaches again, ninety nine cents a pound for peaches or nectarines. I say they are looking pretty good, especially at that price. We've seen they've been $2.49 at the regular price. $2.99 regular price at Meyer. They have theirs on sale too, though. $0.99 cents a pound, you can use up to five times. Okay, so we got some comments on Sara Lee Bread. A couple different comments. Uh, one was from Oklahoma, and the other one was up in Michigan. So I thought it was kind of funny that it was pretty far away from each other but you guys both had mentioned that you had not been able to find any Sara Lee bread I was at Kroger the other day didn't do a video but they had like two loaves and you know they have some here um, not much though not as much as they usually do uh, it is 419 here now a loaf 419 a loaf but it is buy one get one free this week and that is good until at least at Kroger here until Tuesday August 2nd so yeah, that's, uh, I don't know, you may want to check out Kroger. So the other day we got a comment uh, that someone was having trouble finding Parmesan. The funny thing is when we were at the Kroger Marketplace the other day, I didn't see any Parmesan. None in the cheese area. I did want to point out that this is one that we use a lot. Uh, I use this in my Parmesan crusted salmon and asparagus. Uh, it's the shaved Parmesan. It is a little pricey. Actually, the prices went up. This was $3.99 the last time I bought it. $4.99 now it is really good though i mean this stuff is fantastic um yeah wait till I, it looks like there might have been a sale on it because they just ripped the stickers off uh and they do have sales on this stuff pretty frequently so a couple weeks ago we had gotten some comments when i pointed out the annie chun's meals here uh one of the comments was that you haven't been able to find them we continue to find these low everywhere so these must be very popular did want to point out that they are in a digital coupon this week. Uh, you can use up to five times, $1.79 each, down from $2.99 regular price. It's a pretty good deal if you can find them. Uh, they have a few here, not many. They do have the miso uh, that we did get some comments on. They do have some rice on sale here this week. I just noticed they've got the Thai jasmine, uh, the Kroger Thai jasmine rice, $5.99. Five pounds of it down from 749 it's not too bad so the rice aroni is back up to regular price however the regular price did go up the last time they had this on here it was four for five dollars making these a dollar 25 a box now it is three for four so that makes it a dollar 34 a box these were on sale forever for a dollar a box we bought up some uh so you know they were a dollar 50 at target so a little cheaper than there i guess they do have the Nor rice sides for $1.25 a bag. You do not have to buy four on this. Uh, it says locked in low price, though, so you know what that means. They're going to be going up soon. Seeing a lot of inconvenience stickers on a lot of the Asian foods. We've got a couple. We did a video where we focused a lot on the different Asian foods that they have here. Um, and from the last time we did that, it looks like a lot of the stuff is gone. Um, at least that we went over. They do have the... Uh, noodle kit with sauce uh these kikomins that some people had asked about uh they got the pad thai that's 349 they do have a lot of the different mixes and sauces here uh which is good uh that's what most people were asking about somebody asked about the golden curry japanese curry mix here it is 379 for that ramen noodles even continues to go up in price they have the 12 pack set at 329 now 12 pack for 329 that was 319 uh, the the six packs here are still three for five dollar sixty seven each, but locked in low price. Uh, when how long is that locked in? Uh, 
When we see locked in low price, it usually means it lasts till a certain date, but they don't have a date on here. So I don't know. They're probably going to be going up. So when you find a sale on this stuff and you use ramen noodles, I would buy them up. They did carry the chunky Campbell soups over for another week here. Uh, this sale ends on Tuesday, August 2nd, 2022. Uh, they are $1.67 each. Uh, three for five, but you don't have to buy. They're $1.67 each when you use your Kroger Plus card. Also, last week somebody was asking about the Progresso soups, and if they were on sale, they are not. They are still a whopping $2.99 a piece. Uh, we saw a family dollar the other day. They were like $3.99, which is insane. Uh, I'll never pay this price for Progresso. Uh, hopefully they have a sale on it here soon. Uh, usually when Campbell's does, usually Progresso has their sale first. And then we'll see Campbell. So maybe it'll, you know, we'll, we'll keep an eye out on it. Maybe this will go on sale next week. Hopefully, I don't know. Uh, we'll see. So we got a comment a little while ago that the Amy's Organic Soups did go up in price. Uh, the ones that were $2.99, yes, they did. They're $3.19 now. The ones that were $3.49 are still $3.49 here. So I don't know. Maybe these will go up here at some point. Hopefully not. Um, but yeah, everything continues to go up. So there are digital coupons for the old El Paso tacos this week, $1.79, uh, use up to five times, regular price $2.49, um, and some of the other ones here, $2.29 for the bigger kits, regularly $3.99. If you see here, and I was pointing this out a couple weeks ago, if you remember, uh, this was an issue. This was a problem that we were having about seven or eight months ago. Couldn't find tacos, couldn't find taco sauce. Even, even the tortillas were low or out. So I hope we're not seeing that happen again here, but we are seeing new inconvenience stickers on this stuff. Been getting a lot of comments on like baking goods and sugar and stuff like that. So had to come check this stuff out today. They do have a lot more than they've had of the four pound domino sugar. $3.79, we've been seeing most places it's gone up to $3.99. Um, $9.49 for the 10-pound bag, which that would be the way to go, but sorry for the inconvenience, they don't have any. Also, I was at another Kroger a couple days ago where we didn't do a video, but I noticed that they had a sticker on theirs too and they didn't have any. Oh, uh, wow, look at this. So, Kroger Sugar, their four-pound smidgen spoon sugar did go up here. $2.59. The funny thing is they put low price on it. Now that was $2.39 last week. So is it going up again? Who knows? So we see that they have actually lowered the price on the gold metal flower here. Uh, $4.59 was what it was for the all-purpose uh, five pounds there. Now they have the five pound um, gold metal unbleached for $4.19. I believe that was $4.59 also. Actually, I think that was $4.79 for the unbleached. Um, they do have the 10-pound bag here for $7.99. Maybe flour's gone down a little bit in price. Oh, well, I don't know. The bread flour is still $5.79. Uh, they do have some of their Kroger flour in. And what do we notice here? What is the number one thing that you notice? I'll give you a second. Good? Okay. No inconvenience stickers. None, which means they're getting it in now. Now we saw they had only had those inconvenience stickers up for a couple weeks. If that, I, maybe it was a week. No, I think it was a couple weeks, but uh, good to see that they're getting it back in here and they've taken the stickers down right away. So there's been some questions about the inconvenience stickers and when do they put them up. They, at least at this Kroger, they're putting them up and as soon as they know that they're getting the product in, they take them down. Unless it's like cat or dog food, uh, things that they are constantly out of. Uh, but look at this. Now we were going over this the other day. $6.49 here. $6.49 for the all-purpose flour. What was this at Meyer? $4.79. So their prices haven't gone up yet on the uh, King Arthur. So if you have a Meyer near you and you use this flour, uh, this may not be the place to get it here, but get it at Meyer. They do have the Pillsbury five pound flour for $4.49. Um, and they got the whole wheat flour here, $5.99. So a little pricey on the King Arthur these days. Spices just continue to get hit. I swear, some stores, it's always the bigger stores. Kroger's, uh, Meyer usually seems okay. Walmart was pretty low the last time. They did have that bin 
of all the 99 or well, now they're a dollar eight dollar eight for their spices they went up um and target's usually pretty low but i don't know i mean they do have a lot of these a lot of the mrs dash but i mean you can see here you know it's still pretty wiped look at all this salt uh oh inconvenience sticker on their brand of salt is that morton's uh nope that's kroger wait a minute no, that says morton's plain salt dollar 19 there is some down in there there's some right there i don't know though it is pretty low do you see that kroger's does have some oil in here um you know it's been very low in a lot of different places uh we did see where kroger or walmart had gotten their shipment in uh, it did go up here but anyway there was a lot at walmart which was good to see the prices did go up on the Kroger vegetable oil. It is now $3.29, and the canola oil is now $3.69. So, I don't know. Everything continues to rise. One thing I did just notice here is the 40 ounces of the Crisco canola oil, $6.99. $6.99 for that. That is, that's crazy. Uh, wow, and the vegetable oil was $5.99 last week. Now it is $6.49. Jeez. Okay, so we got some digital coupons on some coffee this week. Got the Starbucks K-Cups here, $6.99 for $10. Uh, regular price, $9.49. So, um, yeah, good deal these days on that. You can use up to five times. Also, the different Green Mountain K-Cup pods, $6.99. Does look like that includes all of their ground coffee, too. That's pretty awesome. Um, they do have, let's see, some different options here. Cold brew, eleven ninety nine regularly for that. Wow, that is that is pretty small for eleven ninety nine. Um, Nine ninety nine on sale though. Uh, they do have more of the Keurig pods. They did change their design. If you notice of the Starbucks here, let's go down and check some of these. Up, oh, no sales on Pete's, unfortunately. Uh, yeah. So the Kroger coffee regular prices did go up to $4.49. However, it is on sale this week, $3.99. And this sale actually extends until August 16th, 2022. I can't believe they raised the regular price on this. They already did. Uh, it was $4.29, now $4.49, but $3.99 for the next couple weeks on this deal. Not much of a sale, but they do have the 8 o'clock coffee that somebody had recently asked about 629 down from 679 and they do have the dunkin donuts uh on sale 799 down from 999 which is just crazy um they have some sales on the bigger ones here too uh still way more expensive than you so at sam's club it's about 42 dollars for 72 of these so you know do the math this is a terrible deal compared to that but i understand if you don't have a sam's club card uh, yeah, that might be a pretty decent deal for you. And with the Green Mountain coffee pods, that does include on the digital coupons of the original donut shop uh, for six ninety nine, uh, down from eight seventy nine. So decent deal there. So I did just notice a little bit of a deal on the eighteen ounces of Pete's coffee here, the ground coffee. Uh, yep, that's ground eighteen ounces. $14.99 with the digital coupon. That's a couple dollars off. Uh, so, yeah. They do have the 8 o'clock coffee, 12 ounces, ground on sale for $5.17, down from $7.49. They also have the bigger ones here for $9.64, 24 ounces, down from uh, $13.99. So, that's a pretty good deal. I thought Kroger's was supposed to have the ground Folgers coffee on sale this week. Uh, it is not. $11.79. That is crazy. They do have some of the decaf here for $12.49. So, yeah, Maxwell House is $10.79 here now, too. This is, wow, that's really expensive for Maxwell House. Somebody asked if we could find the decaf half-calf. Okay, I don't know if this is what you were looking for. Uh, this says the half-caffeine. The medium roast here it is ten dollars and 79 cents all of them are they do have the 30 ounce jug of duncan here duncan coffee down from 22.99 to 18.99 on sale okay i was looking at the ad to see if we missed anything here i did notice that they have their 18 ounce thing of blueberries on sale this week two dollars and 77 cents 
And we got some Athena melons or personal watermelons, $2 a piece, two for four. Somebody mentioned in the comments, they do have the Red Baron pizzas, uh, part of a digital coupon for $2.99. Not a bad deal, it says. Uh, regular price, $3.99. We've been seeing these for $4.99, so I don't, I don't know. Maybe they went down for the regular price. They do have the Kroger bacon on the digital coupon for $3.99. Somebody was asking about Scott Tissue. They do have the Comfort Plus bath tissue, 12 double rolls for $3.99. They've got the Energizer battery, 16 count for $9.99. All these are on the digital coupon that we're going over here. Uh, and they have the Craft Singles. We get comments from time to time on these. Uh, they do have these on sale, $2.79 with the digital coupon. So I don't think I went over the Chuck Roast, but they do have the uh, Boneless Beef Chuck Roast. On sale for $4.77 a pound. Pretty good deal there for Kroger. Uh, also, wanted to point this out here. Uh, four times fuel points through August 16th on all Simple Truth brand items with digital coupon. Scan this to get the deal. I believe you can even get this deal on the website. Uh, but if not, you can get an ad and scan this here and get four times fuel points on all of these Simple Truth products. I guess that are on the digital coupon. So I did just notice that they are putting up the locked in low price with no expiration date on the Barilla. Okay, so this to me, this is just as, just the same as saying low price. We don't know when it's gonna go up, but we know things are changing because they've changed the regular stickers to these. Kroger is definitely having an issue again getting in their different uh, spaghettis here. Uh, Kroger spaghetti, $1.99. Oh, that's, okay, that's the two pounds. That is up from $1.59. Uh, that's, okay, still a little cheaper than one pound, I guess. Because it would be $1.34 for one pound at three for four dollars. $1.99, still a little cheaper, I guess. They do have the cremette on sale, four for five dollars. You do not have to buy four, $1.25 each, but look at this. They are low, and look at what we're seeing here. We're seeing inconvenience stickers everywhere, guys. I'm just not pointing it out as much today because, uh, you know, just trying to find the sales and things you guys have asked about today. Well, guys, I hope we were able to go over some of the things that you guys had asked about today. Uh, check out some sales. Lots of digital coupons here this week. We're probably going to be going to Kroger Marketplace on Friday. There's so much going on. We'll check out a lot of the frozen items, a lot of the dairy stuff like that some of the things we've missed so if there's anything you would like for me to check out at kroger the next time we go let me know down in the comments guys thank you so much for watching today with all that being said i am out and always remember the adventure is out there